Linda Ronstadt, hailed as one of the most beloved stars to grace the stage, possessed a voice so celestial that it earned her admiration worldwide. With a collection of 11 Grammys and numerous other accolades, her talent knew no bounds. Yet, amidst her soaring success, a piece of news shattered her world, plunging her into chaos, decay, and sympathy. What was this revelation, and how did she navigate through it? Join us as we delve into the story. Born on July 15, 1946, in Tucson, Arizona, Linda Ronstadt was destined for greatness from her earliest days. Her voice, a gift beyond compare, promised to leave an indelible mark on the music industry. Raised in a nurturing family environment, Linda's childhood reverberated with melodies that filled her heart with joy. Encouraged by her parents, Gilbert and Ruth Mary Copeman Ronstadt, Linda's passion for music blossomed. Drawn to the enchanting sounds of traditional Mexican music, Linda found solace and inspiration in its rhythms and lyrics. This connection to her Mexican heritage, inherited from her father, would shape her musical journey profoundly. Excelling academically at Catalina High School, Linda's love for music flourished as she joined the folk trio, the three Ronstadt, alongside her siblings, Peter and Susie. Together, they enchanted audiences and laid the groundwork for Linda's future stardom. Leaving the deserts of Tucson behind, Linda pursued her dreams at the University of Arizona, where she honed her vocal talents. Forming the band Stone Ponies with Bobby Kimmel and Kenny Edwards, Linda embarked on a musical odyssey that would captivate audiences worldwide. Albums like Heart Like a Wheel, Simple Dreams, and Hasten Down the Wind showcased Linda's unparalleled vocal prowess, earning her adoration and acclaim. However, in the year 2000, Linda's life took a drastic turn as she began to notice a decline in her once powerful vocals. Struggling to sing, her voice faltered, leaving her voiceless and bewildered. Initially dismissed as mere nerves, the truth soon became apparent. Linda's remarkable gift was slipping away. The loss of her vocal range plunged her into despair, as memories of her illustrious career flashed before her eyes. Despite facing this adversity, Linda Ronstadt's resilience shone through as she confronted the challenges head-on. Though her journey was fraught with obstacles, her legacy as one of the greatest voices in music remains untarnished, a testament to her unwavering spirit and enduring talent. Over the next five or six years, Linda Ronstadt persevered, continuing to grace the stage with the support of her talented bands and backup singers, despite her diminishing abilities. Determined to pursue her passion, albeit with limitations, she scaled back her touring commitments to the bare minimum. Despite the frustration of a voice that could no longer sing, she released solo albums like Coming to Myself in 2004 and collaborated on A Dew False Heart in 2006 with Anne Savoy. However, in November 2011, Ronstadt made the difficult decision to bid farewell to her fans, acknowledging the reality of her condition. To offset the loss of income from touring, she embraced an offer from Simon Schuster to write her memoir, pouring her heart into the project. It was during this time that her trembling hands caught the attention of a concerned friend, prompting her to seek medical advice. The diagnosis was devastating, Parkinson's disease. Ronstadt not only lost her melodic voice but also faced mounting physical challenges, including excruciating back pain and difficulty with everyday tasks. In August 2013, she bravely revealed her condition to the world, shedding light on her battle with progressive supranuclear palsy, PSP, a rare brain disease that affected her balance, movement, and coordination. Despite the challenges, Ronstadt's resilience and courage shone through. Honored with induction into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in 2014 and awarded the National Medal of Arts by President Barack Obama, she continued to inspire admiration and appreciation. Settling in San Francisco's Seacliff community, she focused on building a new life surrounded by her supportive children and dedicated herself to regular exercise for her well-being. In the midst of adversity, Linda Ronstadt found solace in the unwavering support of her friends. Renowned musicians like Jackson Brown, Paul Simon, and her ex-boyfriend Jerry Brown were constant presences, offering comfort and reminiscing about shared memories. 
Longtime collaborator Emmylou Harris traded harmonies for household chores, embracing the simplicity of domestic life amid their storied past. Surprisingly, after a period of absence, Linda Ronstadt made a rock return to the public eye in 2018. Making semi-regular appearances with a conversation with Linda, she bravely discussed her career and health challenges, accompanied by clips of her memorable concert performances. Despite the difficulties she faced when speaking, she persevered, revealing her struggle with Parkinson's disease. Ronstadt disclosed that she belonged to the unfortunate minority of Parkinson's patients who did not respond to increased dopamine, leading her to discontinue her regular medication. Returning to the public sphere came with its share of obstacles. During the Music Cares Person of the Year Gala in February 2019, while honoring her dear friend Dolly Parton, an embrace from Parton unexpectedly knocked Ronstadt off balance causing her to accidentally knock the prestigious award off the podium, shattering it. It was a vulnerable moment that showcased her resilience. Shortly after the gala, she embarked on a trip to Mexico with Jackson Brown as part of a cultural arts program to teach children music and dance. In September 2019, she stepped back into the limelight for the release of the long-awaited documentary, Linda Ronstadt, The Sound of My Voice. Despite discussing the loss of her physical abilities and remarkable singing voice, she maintained unwavering optimism, expressing that she could still sing in her imagination. Today, Ronstadt's focus lies in accepting her condition. Her rare diagnosis presents daily struggles, turning even simple tasks into challenging endeavors. Nevertheless, she remains determined, continually adapting to her new circumstances. When asked for advice for others facing a similar diagnosis, Ronstadt emphasizes immediate acceptance. Linda Ronstadt's journey serves as a testament to her unwavering spirit and ability to find hope in difficult times. Though Parkinson's disease silenced her celestial voice, her legacy lives on in the hearts she touched with her music and her indomitable spirit. Despite the trials she faced, her passion for music remains a powerful reminder of the human spirit's resilience in adversity. If you enjoyed this video, there's a good chance you'll also enjoy the one showing on your screen right now. Click enjoy and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. See you on the next one.